Hey my loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome so back. if you're a returning <laughs> subscriber and you're back here to check what are we doing thank you so much for coming back you know i appreciate your support i love you so much if you're new to this channel and you just popped in you know please do subscribe we would love to have you join our family okay okay so in today's video i'm gonna be showing you guys how i did this makeup look and I'm going to be replying to the questions that I got on my Instagram um, Q&A that I did a few days ago. So if you'd like to get to know me better or you'd like to see a response to your question, if you did ask me any questions, do tune in. So we're ready to start. I've already prepped my skin. I just applied my face moisturizer because you know you always have to make sure that your skin is well prepped before you can apply any kind of makeup so that you can avoid any breakouts. Okay. All right. So let's get started. All right. So the first question that I got um, was what keeps you motivated and to keep moving forward? Well, what keeps me motivated is actually reaching my goals so i'm always always working on something because just not doing anything makes me very bored so reaching the goals that i have set for myself definitely keeps me going and it keeps me motivated also learning new things keeps me moving oh and also i love 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 sharing anything that i do learn with the others that also keeps me motivated you know knowing that i am able to assist the next person in order for them to reach their own goals as well that i love okay all right the next question that i got was how do you incorporate um working out into your schedule you have a banging body <laughs> oh thank you thank you honey so making time to go to the gym is absolutely one thing that i'm always gonna be able to do i'm gonna find time to go to the gym because you know it just makes me feel like after a full busy day making someone else money i can actually slot in a minute for myself if you get what i mean it makes me feel like i can actually make time for myself to do something for me for my own benefit so definitely going to the gym is something that I'm actually gonna, you know, I always, always, always force myself to make that time. Because if I can make a full eight hours of my day to go to work, why can't I make an hour to go work on myself? Yeah. So I always either work out in the morning before I go to work or after work. So in that way, that me time channel. <laughs> The next question that I got was whether I have a crush. <laughs> I uh, you no no child. I do not have a crush. I just don't no man. I just don't have that kind of time. You know, a crush is really just a waste of time. <laughs> So no, I don't have a crush. The next question was, when was the last time you cried? Uh -uh. Look, I don't cry very often. I hate feeling vulnerable. I hate looking vulnerable. I just hate everything about that. So I don't cry very often. I haven't cried in a very long time. I cry only when it's necessary. Okay, I'm not a cry baby. Okay. <laughs> so no i haven't cried in a very long time i can't even remember when was the last time i cried hope that answers your question all right so the next question that i got was whether i give second chances uh <laughs> 
Uh, honestly, that depends on 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 what you did in the first place. To be honest, I don't. Okay, the simple answer is I do not give second chances. You fuck up the first time, you'll fuck up again. Unfortunately, doesn't matter what context it's on. So no, I don't give second chances. You fuck up, you go. Period. <laughs> what is the last song you listened to? <laughs> and simply and so papi ye will in there. And simply <laughs> Ooh, I, I, Ooh, I love that song. <laughs> I think it's my favorite song. So yeah, there is a last song I listened to. And recently, and so happy, he will And recently, and so happy. Next question that I got was, what is your biggest fear? Yeah. Oh, cool, fuck guys. Yo, death, child. Yo, yo, nga shona, yaz nga shona. Ay nga shona shame. Tabanga, tabanga ngim sa ngingje nga shona. Ay nga shona ko spin. Yo nga I don't know, man. Death right now. I am really freaked out of death death at this moment because it would fucking feel like I don't know yo I don't know it yo I'd, I'd probably come back I'd be the ghost that you guys have never seen before I would be everywhere I was <laughs> you yo I'd be a ghost you guys because I'm just not ready you know I'm just doing so much right now I'm doing such a lot of stuff so ukufa currently like inga ukubona le nokuthi ingathi ukukhutshwe icephe emlonyeni yeah mhm that's exactly how it would feel like and yeah i think i understand why abanye abantu bebuya beze ghost because cha hmm na dife yo yo alright next question that i got was <laughs> this is a real funny one are you the jealous type? <laughs> better would you do to up? Better. <laughs> no, for real though. <laughs> for real, you guys. Yo, do not greet my man. Do not talk to him. Do not call him. Do not touch him. Do not. Do not smile at him. Do not look at him. Better would you sign him to one? What is your favorite song? <laughs> my favorite song. Oh, I love music. I love music so much. Anyway, I'm going back with that color. So my favorite song, my all-time favorite is Mario. Let me love you. Oh, mm, yeah. Mm, mm. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, mm. Yeah, you guys, I can't sing. Can't sing to save my life, but I love singing. Uh huh. So yeah, I love that song. Baby, I just don't get it. Do you enjoy being hurt? I know you smell the perfume, the makeup on the shirt. Hey, I don't believe the stories. You know the fair. Yeah, that's yeah. Song. Do you believe in love? <laughs> oh, I believe in love, Chong. I believe in love so much, and I know that it does exist because I have felt it, and I still continue to feel it, child. Nothing beats being in love, finding love, being loved, being able to love back. It's just... So, yeah, I believe in love. I believe that there is... A kind of love out there that defeats everything you know 
is a preachy. <laughs> so if you haven't found child, sorry, if you haven't found love, just know that there is love out there that you can still find, and love that is so fulfilling. Yeah. Yeah. So I've been loved. I am loved. And I believe in love. Period. Not posting or anything, but we are loved the side. Okay. Is there anyone you hate? Do I hate anybody? Yo. No. No, actually there is. There is someone I truly hate. They, I, I actually almost said no because I forgot. Uh, I forgot it actually exists. But yeah, there is someone I truly hate. Purely because... He's just so damn irresponsible. Someone I'm supposed to be very close to. If I'm being honest. But I just can't bring myself to... To forgive, you know, to forgive. How irresponsible he is. So yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. I don't have much hate in me at all. But once I start disliking, I wouldn't say hate really, but once I start disliking you because of the things that you do or you've done before, it's just so hard to go back. You know, it's just so hard to some things are forgivable some things are not okay so yeah there is someone that i try by all means to keep the distance from but i just can't stand him a very close someone actually so yeah I don't know if I would call it hate, on, to be honest, but uh, it's somewhere along those lines. All right, the next question that I got. Yo, I need deep, I need deep, need, yo, I need deep, need, nah, son. All right, so when your mom passed away, how did you feel about that? Or how do you feel about that right now? Yo, I need deep, son. <laughs> Okay, so let me just quickly show you guys this. this is the eyeliner that I'm using. So when my mom passed away, I didn't feel anything actually because I was like only six. So she passed away when I was six and we were not even staying together. So when that happened, I literally don't remember feeling anything. So no i didn't feel anything and to be honest it does sometimes for some type of way like i never knew her so i do sometimes feel like um our time together was taken away from us too soon but but at the same time because i didn't know her that much so it's hard really for me to to feel anything but yeah when people talk about their moms and and stuff it just feels weird you know even the word mom feels weird on my mouth because i'm not used to saying to saying mom to anyone so, so yeah no it just doesn't it doesn't bother me much and actually we recently ah oh, never mind yeah it doesn't. I'm okay, child. I'm surviving. 
what can we do really all right the next question that i got is do you drink ivo <laughs> Don't even ask me that ever. <laughs> I don't just drink. Swim in it. I swim in it. guys. Listen, I believe it. I believe it. It's a boom. I can't believe I said that. <laughs> I thought it was wild. So ghetto. You are a boom. So yeah, yeah, I drink. I drink a lot. Okay. Well, not, not, never mind. I, yeah, I drink. Yeah. Actually, yes, yeah, you asked. Cheers to that. Fella Paga to go was an bulala, guys. <laughs> Favorite of all time. All right, so the next question that I got was oh, a random fact. Yo, a random fact. Yo. Is there anything random about me really? Back in high school, I was bullied. Yeah. I was bullied because I was very ugly. I lacked self-confidence. Well, at least until I reached um, grade 11. Yeah, I think. But yeah, I was bullied a lot. Right through primary, primary school, actually. And then beginning of my high school years. Yo, I was really ugly. <laughs> well, I wasn't... Yeah, no, I was. I was ugly. Okay. So yeah, I was bullied. And also, I was a bit of tomboyish. Alright, the next question that I got is what is your weakness? My weakness is, is the fact that once um so I am generally a very bubbly person. I talk a lot and I am always I'm mostly in that type of um mood you know talking chatting laughing but once my mood gets disturbed or once i get into like sort of like a saddish type of mood it's just so hard for me to get myself out of it so it takes me like literally hours to work on my mood just to to make it better so yeah, that is one of my weaknesses and sometimes it annoys me too. But who the, who the hell takes the whole day to get better? Also, it takes very little to, to put my, my mood off. So you can imagine, how many exes do you have? What is that? What? What is it? How many X's do I have? What is an X? Let me see. I'm just gonna Google that word quickly because it doesn't exist in my vocabulary. Let me see. Just gonna. No. No. Even Google doesn't have that word, so. Oh, oh, something's coming up. An ex. No, I don't have, I, I don't own any exes. 
I don't have any <laughs> any exes because I don't like digging in the dirt. Okay. So no. No exes this side. So I'll drink to that. So oh, I love this concealer, you guys. This is life, I promise you. It's life, life, life. Never mind. I was just thinking of something now. So, the next question that I got is let me see quickly. Oh shucks, where am I? Who was the last person you texted? That's my sister. My book says is the last person I texted. I text her every day. I'm the annoying, annoying the little sister. How many siblings do you have? And what? No, I suppose you mean go sing up. Alright. I have four siblings. I'm the fifth one. Which means I'm the last born of the five. We had another um sibling, our big sis. But then she passed away a while ago, in, like back in 2003. So there's only five of us now. So, yeah. Sorry, I forgot to show you that. Is there someone you trust? Trust in, in what context? Oh my god. um i trust myself <laughs> uh, to be honest guys i your trust your i don't know trust is such a big word you know it's just so hard for me to to just give it just like that so yeah I trust myself though because I know I never I never do anything I never do anything bad to myself of course except drinking which I know is bad for my health but to be honest I don't trust anyone <laughs> You? You're a nurse born. Oh, I don't trust anybody. Shame. I just can't. You? Ninja Nina. What is your favorite color? Yo, I love it when you guys gave me these simple questions. That was wow. Yeah, I'm asking questions as here. Is it deep? Is it too much? My favorite color right now, actually, I am torn between white, black, and beige. So those three colors actually are all my favorites because it's just so easy to um, you know that you can just dress them with any other color you can literally play around with those colors you know to put together your outfits and 
and still look very good so yeah i love i love all of them actually it's hard to choose one so let me see if i really really have to choose one come to think of it if the world was coming to an end right and you can only choose one color that you can use you know when you're in heaven because i so i'm going to heaven okay i'm going to heaven so i only had one color that i can wear in heaven what color would i choose okay i think i'll just go with white i'll just okay i'll choose white so yeah i'll take white okay the next question yo i ask so many questions yo. The next question that I got is, what was the last thing you bought? The last thing I bought... Does it count if... It's not my own money. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Um, the last thing I bought with my money... Was... I'm trying to think of what I What was it? What did I buy? Petrol. That's petrol card. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it was. It was petrol. Oh, food. Okay, it was food. Junk food. Writing. Let me see if there's any other question that I haven't answered yet. I actually think I've answered everything. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. The next question that I got is. Have you ever done drugs? <laughs> I'm like, oh, it drugs, guys. I know that you can do drugs other than alcohol because sure, alcohol is drugs too, you know. So the only drugs that I do is alcohol. If you don't know that alcohol is drugs, when someone asks um, ask you that question the next time, tell them that yes, you do drugs. Okay. Oh, this step, you guys, is everything. So alcohol is drugs. Okay. Alcohol is drugs. So... I do, I drink alcohol and I smoke ochre. Does that count as drugs? I don't know. But other than that, no. I don't do the hectic drugs and I've never done them before. They scare the shit out of me and I'm God's child. We don't do that. So no. Okay. All right, my love. So I applied my lashes off camera, as you guys can see, it was a quite a hassle. <laughs> so I'm just gonna um do my lips quickly. So I'm gonna be using this brown pencil with this um lip color from Maybelline. It's in color. 55 okay so i'll just do that quickly 
and I have the last question that I got so the last question is whether I have any kids and if I want to have if no do I want any in the future so I don't have kids right now and yeah so no I don't have any kids right now and I do want kids in the future hopefully in the near future because I feel like I'm ready you know all right my loves so here is a finished look I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for tuning in if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe i really 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 appreciate your support thanks again bye